flea market falcon here i swoop in and i scoop up the deals not a lot of people it rained early this morning so only a few vendors but i'm sure i'll find something got a bunch of pretty good cds here could you do seven for five no dollar piece cool all right i got five right here tried to get a deal i wanted a few extra bucket head ones that i didn't want to pay a full dollar for but that's okay this one sells for about 50 bucks that's awesome right here that i found that got this one electric tears got another bucket head with less clay pool yeah got this one the craft not the soundtrack but the score this is very hard to find and the same with this one, the Crow. A lot of people, they own the Crow soundtrack, but this is the Crow score. Heck yeah. I always test the bearings and that one just doesn't stop. You're the flea market man that I remember. Yes, good to see you. How are you? You're the flea market falcon. Yeah, swooping in. Swooping in to scoop up that deal. How are things in the rain? No complaints, we're here. Uh -huh. Not as many of us, but there's, there's a few of us here. Movies are a dollar, we'll take them all for 40 bucks. Thanks, Tom. Huh, 40 dollars, huh? Lots of Blu-rays. They have all these blue Raymonds. So pretty good deal, all of these for 40, but I don't need them. This is a good movie, Snowpiercer. I am gonna grab this one, Maggie, for a buck with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Random tapes. You got a bunch of salsa tapes and Double-sided. Yeah. How would you ask on the whole thing? Two dollars for the Case Logic case, double-sided. You get the tapes free. That's amazing. Two dollars, sure. And I'll grab the Arnold movie. Maggie. So just grabbed a few things today. Was very happy to find Maggie for a buck. Heck yeah, Arnold in like a post-apocalyptic movie. Definitely going to be watching that bunch of these bucket head CDs and bucket head with less clay pool and like I pointed out the crow not the soundtrack but the score and the craft score also those are very hard to find glad I got to pick those up we also got the cassette double-sided case it was a little wet so I opened it up to dry it off but they're on cases so it doesn't really matter what I have noticed about these uh, Spanish tapes, a lot of times they're bootlegs. You can tell like, you know, if there's no writing on the opposite side of the inlay, it's probably a bootleg. You can clearly tell by that like circle through the barcode. So like this one looks pretty good on the tape, but then you look at like this one, horrible. <laughs> That's it for this week. Let's jump ahead to next. And we're back, baby. How much are the figures? Five, five bucks each? Yeah. Three if you take all of them. Yeah, so let, let me know how you make Oh, that's Gary's right there. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> that's a lot of wrestlers. How much you want for the whole box? Uh, well, I was thinking two bucks a piece, or there's like a hundred there, so I mean, you make me an offer. Uh huh. Thank you very much. Really have no idea what these are worth. How about 40 bucks for the whole thing? No, uh, I was already off at 100 and I turned it down. So yeah. it's gonna be over 100. Yeah. Uh-huh. I definitely wouldn't pay 100 for all these, but good luck to whoever buys them. A Nintendo game CD. Hey, what did you say? I'm sorry. 
I was talking to myself. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. Well, not myself. All the special viewers out there. Got the three cassettes. These two are sealed. They got Nerf dog. You shoot dogs with Nerf guns. You know it's cold when the display case is completely frozen. How much are these games? Um, two bucks each. Two bucks each? Cool. Uh, can you not put the basketball on the comic I want to buy? Okay, so you said the games are two bucks. How much? I'm interested in like the Star Wars, maybe the VHS, uh, like maybe the comic, maybe that game. The playing cards. Fifteen. Uh, any like certain price on each one? Just curious. Is like anyone more than another? You know, I mean, what do you got there? Those two games, the yeah. two VHSs, and the Star Wars cards. Yeah. Like twelve bucks. Uh. -huh. I don't, I don't really know, just like bundle price on it. Yeah. So that right there. Take it. Thank you. He threw this in for free grind scholastic book has a rip on the back, but still it's funny that this is a book. So I swooped in on those deals. So got all this stuff from that guy for $12. I was already definitely gonna buy Tomb Raider and Predator uh, for $2 each. So then it's like for eight bucks, I got all this stuff. These VHS right here, Star Wars Trilogy. This actually sells really well, so that's a, a good score right there. The Jordan vs. Bird electronic uh, tiger game there. Hopefully it works. Masters of the Universe 4 comic. That's worth a little bit. The problem with the flea market comics is they're almost never mint condition, but I'll take what I can get. And then the grind scholastic book thrown in for free. Yeah. And we can't forget the Texas Chainsaw Massacre playing cards. Also can't forget this, might as well show this off. Yesterday I was at an auction and bought a box of video games, mostly Nintendo. And they are the nastiest games I've ever seen in my life. Looks like they were stored in a car's engine. Horrible condition, but only paid 20 bucks, so can't complain too much. Hopefully I can make my money back. These are so beyond, like, disgusting. This might be the worst condition game I've ever seen in my life. There's, like, cobwebs inside the cartridge. Arkanoid. Classic. This is a good baseball game right here. Nothing. I grabbed a couple of things. The Super Mario Twins. Under any game right here, the skateboarding section is actually pretty fun. Almost looked over the Friday the 13th yeah. comic. Pretty cool right there. How much are you asking on the comics? Two bucks each. Two bucks? What a bunch of them I give you the other. Yeah. Also got the Beavis and Butthead Encyclopedia. Black Hole, Shadow, John Carter 1. No, 2, sorry. Here's 1. Dark Man. Frankenstein, Star Trek. Okay, 15. 
Thank you. Thank you. They got some VHS here. Dune. Yes, it is. Yeah, Will you take 50 cents for this? What is it? Uh, tape. VHS movie. I don't even know she's selling this one. No? I gotta wait till she comes back. She might just... she comes back since she's selling it. I don't even know. Where was it? In the box down there. Oh, was it? Yeah. Alright, I'll have to check. Okay, thank you. Yeah? Really, she's gonna make me come back to buy a VHS tape that I only kind of want. Smash Burger. It's always funny to me how they basically stole GameStop's logo, font, and colors. They got these spin magazines, Metallica and Needles from Back to the Future Part 2 and 3. Oh, and Kiefer. How are you? How you doing, man? Good. I'll give you a buck on the magazines That's on each one. The spin yeah, magazines. So, two bucks. Yeah. Have any more like that? No, nah, just uh, just stuff. And how much are the cassettes? Uh, uh, four for a dollar. Oh, awesome. Yeah, some of them are beat, but yeah. there's a couple layers, yeah. There's all kinds of, two, yeah. one, all the DVDs, two, CDs. Three, four, yeah. five. Yeah, four, 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 four. Wanna just do five bucks on the whole thing? Yeah, that sounds four good. For you, yeah. That sounds good. Appreciate can you like swoop in and something and get them? <laughs> you can even swoop it in. Yeah. Scoop up you the want, deal. You can take the, you can take the, <laughs> you know what's funny is I mentioned, I said to my test dog, I said, I says, he's, you, you come out of your shell more on video. I find that you're a little more shy when you're here. Of course. But on well, your video, was... you're more, you're a lot more exuberant. I'm suing the uh, manufacturer of Smart Food Popcorn. Are you really? My wife's been eating it for years and it hasn't worked. Uh... <laughs> $3. See, I can say that because she's way down there, right? Yeah. See? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they got DVDs here. Two for fifteen dollars. Got the Spider-Man. I don't think he realizes it's upside down. It's supposed to be like that, right? So the signature on the back is that side up. So I guess he's balancing on his web. Bob Marley new CD. One of the greatest games of all time. Bob the Builder. Can we fix it? Does it take a buck for the two? Uh, no. Let me take a look. Book for this one? I'll skip this one. Let's see him for a second. I will do five bucks for the two. I'll skip this. Thank you, though. All right, good. Sega Genesis, some games Super Street Fighter, Sonic 1 and 2. That's a good game. How much are the games? Depends which one. Uh huh. Street Fighter. Twenty bucks. So what a little jokester that guy turned out to be. Yep. CDs are four for a dollar. I'll grab these. Sarah McLaughlin, only because it's new and sealed. This one, only because it's new and sealed. Frank Zappa. Okay. And I need to grab a fourth one, so I'll throw this in. Why not? Thank you. I changed my mind. I'll grab this one instead. How you doing, buddy? I swooped in. I scooped up some deals. Flea Market Falcon had an okay day. The best score was that Predator game that we looked at earlier, the Predator Concrete Jungle for Xbox. Uh, we already looked at all that stuff. Also got uh, like the magazines and the CDs. So got the bin of cassettes for $5, which I didn't really show off, so I'll do that now. These ones aren't quite as good. These ones are a little bit better. This one right here. Now, as a kid, our family, we used to wheel in the television from the from the living room into the dining room so that we could watch Jackie Gleason as we eat. Those were the good old days back then. Uh, we got The Last of the Mohicans. A lot of soundtracks here, which I like. I collect soundtracks. Not really say like Last of the Mohicans, but I'll probably put like Animal House in my collection. 
probably not Rain Man, but probably My Girl. And I'll definitely put the Rocky Horror Picture Show in my collection. That one's really cool. Got some more here. We got a U2, B-52s. B-52s are awesome. And all these Starship and Jefferson Starship tapes in Poison. That does it for today. Thanks for watching. I appreciate that. Make sure to like and subscribe if you feel like it. You can click that bell if you want to get notifications. I don't care what you do. I'm just happy you're watching. I'll see you next time around. I'm out of here. Cut!